Hey, it's your boy Nathan here, AKA Six Cinema. Welcome back to the channel. Um, it's been a while since I made a video, but I am back. It's a new year, 2022. I hope you had a great 2021. Um, definitely some of my goals for this year are to create more videos because I started off pretty decent when the pandemic started in 2020, making a video every week and uh, kind of fell off. You know, working nine to five doesn't help. A full-time job definitely does not help creativity, but uh, I'm back at it. I got another video for you. And if you're new to this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button, I guess. I don't know. I'm just gonna show you this video anyway. So welcome to my office, uh, my desk tour, whatever you wanna call it. I'm gonna show you what I did to put together this space because honestly to me, being in a creative space is definitely one of the best things you can do. Now that I have this space, I'm, I'm making more videos. As you can see, like this is my first video of the year, but I shot two other videos today. But let's just get into it. I'm gonna walk you around and show you a couple of things that I picked up to make this space more of my own. So to start off, take a look at this desk originally I wanted to go with the Alex drawers for the desk legs and base instead of going with those Alex drawers because they're usually sold out I grabbed these Mickey drawers here which look great um, I got them in black which most of the time you can't get for Alex drawers because they're always sold out so i got these mickey drawers for about 85 dollars and they do their job and the good thing about these drawers is that they're cheaper than the alex drawers and they do come with wheels you don't have to use the wheels i ended up putting them on because you never know when you want to just slide your desk around and move it around in the room so i thought that having the wheels on there would be a good idea and having the wheels on the desk made it a little bit higher and because i'm a taller guy um it just made sense to have the desk a little higher because i don't want to be sitting all the way down on the ground next i have this tabletop here it is a dark brown tabletop from ikea as well and it is great it is such a nice space it's wide it's longer than my previous desk so i have so much room things aren't as crowded and i have room to work and not just have things on my desk like speakers and a computer so the next thing i did was add some new lighting and i went with a warmer tone this time because I don't know if you saw my last studio tour from 2021 in my previous apartment. Um, I'll link it right here if you haven't seen that one, but I use a lot of cool lighting and the vibe was good. Like it was, I liked it, but it was very gamer. I don't know if you know what gamer rooms usually look like, but that's definitely what it was. So for this office, as you can see, I got some warmer lighting here. This light over here, um, this was actually from my living room. I didn't need it in the living room anymore. So I was like, why not just bring it into my office and who cares? Like, why do I need to buy new lighting? So I brought this over and it looks great. This light right here is awesome. I literally just picked this up maybe two, three days ago. And the one thing I really like about it is it clamps to the side of the desk. And another great thing about it is it takes a regular light bulb. So I was able to use one of my old Govi RGB LED light bulbs and I can change this to whatever color I want. So for the rest of my desk, I have some of the same items that I've had before, um, like my Aki desk mat, which is perfect. Uh, looks great with the space. One thing I did add to this desk was a monitor riser. Um, I didn't really need it, but having it underneath it gives like a nice little space for me to put all my hard drives and my audio interface and if i want to i can put my laptop up there and just have everything out of the way so the desk is nice and free and clear and organized um other than my desk i have added a whiteboard because my organization was lacking a little bit and i think that's what was stopping my creativity so I've got the whiteboard here. Anytime I have an idea, I just roll over to the left of my desk and I write down those ideas so I don't forget them. And then other than this side that you can see right here, my pegboard that I have used in my old office space. Um, and below that, I have a shelving unit that I also got at IKEA. I can't remember the name right now because I bought it over a year ago, but um, this unit is great. The two top shelves I use to store my camera, my lenses, and my drones. And underneath is a cupboard that I have a charging station. So that's one of the things I wanted to do was create a charging station so I can have 
all of my batteries that I used in one spot and I can just leave them there, have them charging so they're ready to go for the next time that I need to use them. Um, yeah, so I think that's it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, let me know if you have any questions in the comments down below. Uh, also, let me know if you like my space and if you would do the same thing or if you would do different things. Um, just leave those all in the comments down below. And if you are new to this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. You don't have to, but it would be greatly appreciated if you do because then I can quit my 9 to 5. Ah, the dream. Anyway, that's it for today's video. Uh, again, hope you liked it. I will see you next time with a brand new video. Take it easy. Peace.